Welcome! In front of me I have a Skagen HR Foster 3 and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the iPhone. First thing you will need to do is to turn on the watch and you can do it by pressing and holding the middle button. Keep holding the button until you see the Skagen logo on the screen. Once you see the logo, you can uh, release the button and wait until the watch turns on. And after the watch turns on, you should see the uh, tap to begin message on the screen. Once you see it, tap on the screen and it will open the list of languages. And uh, once you see this list, you can scroll through it by swiping up and down on the screen. Find the language you would like to use on your watch and once you find it, tap on it to select it. After you select the language, tap on the check mark. And now we need to download and install the Wear OS application on our iPhone. So uh, make sure you have the internet connection and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do, open the uh, App Store on your iPhone. In the App Store, tap on the search icon, tap on the search bar and type in uh, Wear OS and tap on search. Scroll through the list of apps, find the Wear OS by Google, tap on it then tap on the get button to download and install it. And once the application is done installing, tap on the open button to open it. In the app, tap on start setup. Here you can agree to send the diagnostic data if you want to by checking the box. If you don't want to, you just simply uncheck it. And once you're done, uh, come on. You can tap on agree. Then uh, if you need to enable Bluetooth sharing, tap on enable, tap on OK, and the app should detect your watch. Once it does, tap on the watch to select it. Okay, something went wrong. Let's try again. So I'm gonna tap on the screen, select the language, Tap on the check mark. Okay, now I'm gonna tap on retry. And this time it worked. Okay. Once you see this pop up, tap on pair. Tap on confirm. Now we can connect our watch to the Wi Fi network. You can do it by selecting the network, entering the password, uh, and then the uh, network will be saved on our watch or you can also skip this step and keep the watch disconnected from the Wi-Fi network. I'm gonna connect once, I'm gonna tap on the network, enter the password. And then tap on join. And here we can uh, copy a Google account to our watch. Uh, basically, if you want to use the Google services on your watch, like uh, Play Store, uh, Gmail and stuff like that, you need to copy a Google account to it. If you don't care, you can uh, key, uh, tap on use Wear OS without an account and basically uh, that not copy the account. And if you need it later, you can also do it later if you want to. Uh, to copy the account, basically tap right here to open the list of accounts, select the account and then tap on the continue button and enter the password to confirm. Um, so tap on continue for example. Now we need to enter the password to confirm that it's our account. And once you're done and you log in, it will copy the account and then you will see this page. And here we can uh, tap on continue and we can allow or deny the uh, permission for the calendar. If you want to use the calendar feature on your watch, you need to allow the permission. If you don't care, you can deny it. Next, we have the notifications. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch, you need to allow the permission. If you don't care, you can keep it uh, denied. I'm just going to allow it and then Again, the notifications or contacts rather, you can allow the permission or deny it. Then we can tap on continue, allow or deny the permission for the location. 
And once you're done with the permissions, the setup will finish. Once you see this screen, tap on done. And at this point, you should see your Foster Free watch on the in the app on the device page. We need to wait until the setup is complete on the watch. And after a couple of seconds, you should see the watch face on your watch. The tutorial will pop out and you can tap on learn more and basically follow it and to see how uh, to see the, how the watch works. OK, and that's how you pair this watch with the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.